traders welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you how to trade with candlestick psychology let's start now this is gbp chart chart the trend is up trend here and we are seeing a minor down trend okay i'm going to place a lower option okay i place a lower option because of this continuation of this down trend very strong down trend but here we are seeing a rejection from sellers still we are seeing a bearish candle at the buyers area means the sellers wants to go down that's why i placed a reller option okay, let's see what happens here okay because of this momentum Okay, there is no reversal at the buyers area still we are seeing a bearish momentum okay. so there is a rejection here so it better to wait for this candle to close then we can place our trade So the buyers may enter into the market because we are seeing a upper rejection in the market. It means the buyers wants to enter in the market. So the buyers enter into the market, but the buyers are very weak. Huh? Okay, very strong buyers entry. So it's better to wait for the rest, right momentum, because the buyers are very strong. We can't go with this bearish momentum. sellers wants to continue okay, I placed a lower option because the sellers wants to continue because I saw some strong rejection from sellers so we can expect a bearish candle because this is a retracement candle I think that's why I placed a lower option okay, let's see what happens here okay Okay, this is also a winning trade okay i placed two trades because of this retracement i placed a lower option because of this rejection i placed a lower option okay i placed two trades with 100 dollars this is my first trade because of this momentum because of this rejection at the buyers area there is no buyers entry still i am seeing a weak weak sellers entries with strong rejection from buyer sellers means the sellers wants to continue to this level Okay, this is a buyers area there is a strong rejection that's why i didn't place my trade here because of these rejections because of these buyers entries but i placed my trade here because i saw a rejection from sellers that's why i placed here a lower option okay i will okay i got very huge profit here with 100 dollars i got 250 dollars okay, i want to withdraw this money in front of you Okay, I invested hundred dollars. With hundred dollars, I got two fifty dollars profit. Because that two trades is enough. I I think that's why I placed only two trades. We no need to trade more than five trades, more than ten trades per day. If you trade more than five trades, more than ten trades, there are more chances to loss. Because I'm applying here a compounding strategy. That's why. I am trying to place only limited trades per day. Okay. 
it is still loading i don't know what happens okay no problem okay i placed two trades with 100 dollars i got this amount with 100 dollars i don't recommend you to invest more than 10 trade 10 dollars per trade but i placed because i don't have time to make video and i don't have time to trade that's why i invested more this much amount i don't recommend you to enter this much amount always invest low amount and target your make your daily daily target achieve your daily target then leave the market don't trade on even on demo to don't trade once you achieve your daily target don't trade even on demo account okay thank you for watching my video if you like my video like share and subscribe